Do you know what happens when a school gets caught hiring a foreigner illegally or an agent gets arrested for introducing a foreigner? Okay, number one, the agent. If somehow the agent is caught, they pay a fine of 5,000 to 50,000 RMB with a 50,000 max and a 5,000 minimum. The school, they pay a fine of maybe uh, 10,000 RMB to a maximum of 100,000 RMB. And the foreigner, the teacher, he also pays a fine of 10 to 100,000, as well as misses out on his last salary. Then he's arrested for 5 to 15 days. And finally, he's forced to buy an airplane ticket and ban from China for one to five years. So the only one who gets jail time is the foreigner. The only one who's banned from the marketplace is the foreigner. The agent and the school, well, if they're paying minimum fines or not even paying fines, the agent's minimum fine is 5,000. The school's minimum fine is 10,000. For the agent, that's just simply introducing one foreigner to anywhere's profit. And for the school, that's also less than the, than the profit that they make having the foreigner in the school even for a month. So they're they're back in business right away. They're not in jail. They're not banned for five years and they're still making money even when they get caught. Now, personally, I have no comment on the situation. I'm just explaining what happens. And thank you for listening. This is Kyle from Expat Rights.